One of the comments I got from one of my uploads is asking, Does your installed Google application, including Play Store, showed up on the desktop mode? Good morning everyone, CJ here, and for today, we will find out if the installed Google application works on the tablet and desktop mode of Huawei MatePad Pro. I already have Google applications installed on my Huawei MatePad Pro, but would like to explore further. So what I'll do is I'll install all the Google applications available on the Google Play Store so we can validate if the Google application really works on the tablet mode and the desktop mode of the Huawei MatePad Pro. So just a disclaimer, I don't really use all the Google application which is available on the Google Play Store. Um, the most used Google application that I do is uh, Gmail and of course YouTube and Google Chrome. So I have everything installed um, from Google Translate, uh, Sheets, Google Maps, like every Google application that I was able to find on the Google Play Store, I installed it. And since it's already installed, um, let's try to open it one by one. Starting with Google Play Store. Then we'll just close it out. Um, we just need to know if it works or not. And of course, Google, uh, the Google browser. Next, uh, let's open Google Meets. Then uh, Google Classroom. We won't be opening GMS because you won't find anything there. That's Google Hangouts. That one is working too, but I haven't used that, so I need to set it up. But as you can see, it opens uh, with no issues, and uh, it's working. Next is Google Maps. So immediately, you'll have um, the place where you're at, so it, it will give you the map. Next is Task, which is also um, from Google. Then we have Google Drive. Next is Google Calendar. Then Google Slides. Then Photos. Google Photos. Next is Google Sheets. Google Earth. I haven't tried using this one, but uh, it looks interesting. Then we have Keep Notes, which is also from Google. Then Google Translate. Um, I've used this once or twice already when we went outside of the country. Then Google Docs. Google Assistant, which I'm not familiar with. Mm -hmm. 
Next is Google News. Next is Google Lens. Next is YouTube. Google One. Next, we have Google Files. Then we have Gboard. Few more left. We have Google Contacts. Next, we have Street View. Then Photo Scan. Then we have Find My Device. Last but not the least is the Google Browser. So as you can see, all the application works on the tablet mode of the Huawei MatePad Pro. Now, we will proceed in checking those applications on the desktop mode. To access the desktop mode, all you just need to do is to swipe down and then tap on desktop mode. Then it will ask you if you really want to enter the desktop mode. So just hit on enter. The user interface of Huawei MatePad Pro's desktop mode is similar to the Windows UI. But instead of having start on the lower left, you have here the settings and also the applications. It seems that uh, most of the applications we installed along with the games um, is showing on the desktop mode. But for today, we'll just focus on the Google application that we've installed a while ago. We will open it one by one to validate if it really works um, on desktop mode, same as what we did a while ago on the tablet mode. So this time, I won't be mentioning the applications one by one, but we'll start with Gmail. So as a summary, 
um, all the applications that's on the desktop mode is working. And on my list, I actually have 30 Google applications. So out of these 30 applications, there's only two which is not showing on the desktop mode. One is the Google Play Store and the second one is Google Chrome. There is also one application which is showing on the desktop mode, which is voice search, which is not showing on the tablet mode. However, voice search is a feature of Google Chrome. So most likely that's the reason why it's not showing on the tablet mode. So that's the video for today. Hope this one helps. And if it did, give this video a big thumbs up. And uh, of course, put your comments down below. I would like to hear from you. And thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. Bye!